Okay, so I am going to be talking to you about Heidi's Hearts Handmade. I have done a review video in the past, but I was kind of wanting to do sort of an updated review on her. I really, really like her shop, and she is just a all-around super sweet lady. So, and I have so many pads from her now, it's crazy. I am a little bit of an addict, you would say, maybe. But I kind of just keep it a secret and don't, you know, tell anybody. Other than everybody on the internet. But, <laughs> okay. So, let's get started. I'm going, I'm super excited. Okay, so, let me start with by uh, showing you. Oh, they're totally up here. Totally forgot. Okay. I'm going to show you my two. Um, interlabial pads and we're going to call them leaf pads because I get tongue tied super easy so these are my leaf pads this one is flannel also flannel I have three pad wrappers from her I have this cute um, box print and I also have a matching pad to it I have the cute little llamas, and this one's adorable. It is probably my favorite. And I have the Starry Night one. And she does put a kind of like P-U-L-E material on the inside of those. I'm really excited. I just got my pad wrappers and my interlabial, my leaf my leaf pads and I'm excited to use them okay now let's start with my liners I'm gonna have a hard time remembering sizes probably this is an 8 I think it is the only one I have in this style it is a flannel topped and fleece backed and it is a light core she has she puts little you're not going to be able to see it on this pad really she puts um little stars to measure her absorbency and she uses flannel as the core i have one in this and i believe this is maybe an 8.5 and I totally bleach this out <sighs> really irritates me I don't I love them I don't I'm really irritated when my pads don't look perfect <laughs> but I really like this one the cute little birds chirping and everything then we get to two of my absolute favorite from her she is the best, and I will love her forever for making these for me. But I have two. I love Lucy liners. They have red fleece on the back, and they are cotton topped. This is from her Vita Vita Vegemin. I got it, I think, um, episode. Uh, it's one of my favorites. It is just an all-around funny episode. I mean, I love Lucy. She's funny. And then we'll move on to my actual uh, pads. Two more I Love Lucy pads. One from her iconic grape squishing episode and the even more iconic chocolate episode. And these have black fleece. These are moderate. You'll be able to see this a little bit better. They are marked with two stars. And she said all of her pads have about a 2.5 gusset, but it can vary. This is also a moderate. And it matches my pad wrapper. I love this pad. Um, 
this pad right here, this one, and this one. This is how I found her. I basically, for some reason, just got it in my head. I was like, foxes are very adorable. Fox print fabric is so adorable. And I was like, I, I've got to be able to find somebody that has a fox print. So I basically went on to Etsy and I typed it in and she came up and I saw that she wasn't, you know, charging $15 a pad like some people do. And so I ordered. This was my first order from her, these two packs. And when I ordered them, I contacted her and I was like, do you think that you could find I Love Lucy Fabric? She told me she'd do her best and then she gets back to me and lets me know that she found it and the rest is history and I love her. So the next one I'm really excited about, I haven't got to use yet. So I will be using um, it in my upcoming cycle, which is very soon. If not, tomorrow, Wednesday, definitely. I have a 9.5, and that's what I'll, um, like these two, these two Lucy's, this, and this is like 9.5. That's how long it is. This is crushed velvet. I heard that crushed velvet is really hard to work with, kind of like Minky, but look how good of a job she does. She is amazing. Her skills. I mean, I wish I could sew. I mean, I can sew, but not that well. You notice I've never really shown you any of the pads I've made hardly just because they're not that good. And this is the gusset. This is how thick a light pad would be. I got this one to use kind of as a liner. Wanted to try it. And this is how thick her moderate is. And the last one I have in that size, the 9.5 moderate basically is this blue minky and it has blue fleece on the back. I love how she color coordinates. It's just so nice. Makes my OCD very happy. Okay, and so I have two heavies and I think they're 10. I have Minky and let's see. I don't know if the, the gusset may be a little bit bigger for it. But I'm not, yeah, the gusset's about probably close to three for it. But I don't mind a uh, bigger gusset for a heavier pad. And this is how thick her heavies are. And this last one I also haven't tried because it is crushed velvet. It is a very pretty purple. It like, it matches my hair that I did. <laughs> it's very, very pretty purple crushed velvet. And I am so excited to use these crushed velvets. I totally feel like I'm rambling today a lot, so I'm very sorry, but hope that you have been able to get something from my videos. But yes, I love Heidi, and if you're watching this and you haven't checked her out, you really need to. I will put her Etsy shop um, down below. I will put Facebook groups. Um, she has a Facebook group, and I will put it down below must go and you must join and see her stuff because she's amazing. So that is all I have for you today. So I hope you have found this updated review helpful and I will be back with more videos. So thank you for watching.